What is up, YouTube? I'm back again with another video, and I saw that my or my old baseball card video got a lot of attention on my YouTube channel. So I'm coming back at you with another video. Um, I am going to a card show this weekend, so my brother is probably going to pick some stuff up. I may or may not. I haven't decided yet, but you are going to see some cards, uh, more cards this weekend. Uh, my package from the auction that I won with like the really cool silver bullion that I got for really cheap and some seeded coins... That is coming, um, I believe, on Friday, if not Saturday, so you guys will have a video as soon as I get the package. But what you're looking at in front of me is my almost entire 1970s baseball card collection. 99% of the stuff here was found in my grandma's basement in a box. My mom and my mom's sisters collected when they were younger. Um, the stuff in these hard plastic cases here, these were my dad's when he collected in the 80s. And I don't believe they make them anymore, but they're really good sturdy cases, so I'm glad um, I have some now. So I'll start off. So right here in this uh, plastic briefcase looking um, box here are my really low condition cards. I would say probably a, if you want to use the PSA scale, probably PSA 4 and under. But um, there are some good players in here, like I remember there's a Ron Santa right there. That's a pretty nice card, more Ron Santas. So this is the stuff I trade for. Um, again, all different years, 70s. Maybe it's actually all 70, 73, 70, all 73, 74 cards. Um, stuff in here is my really, like, a lot better 70s um, cards and these hard plastics. Here's Dennis Erksley, Rookie, Johnny Bench, Rod Carew, Reggie Jack, Richard Morgan, Steve Carlton. There's Tom Seaver's um, cards. There's a Willie Mays, 73. That's the last year on the uh, plane. That's on the Mets. There's a Reggie Jackson. Here's a Schmidt, uh, second year. Here's the Willie Mays. So that. All right, now on to the box. Let's try and the cards here. So um, what you're looking at here is actually a long box of my uh, cards from here all the way down to here. So it's pretty long. Try and see if I can get a whole view of it for you guys. Remove the uh, tripod back. Okay, yeah, it's not gonna fit all in. Um, pretty far back right now. Um, okay, so. Right here, I don't have much of 72 and before, um, just because that's what not what my mom and my mom's sisters collected. That's all I stuff I got or I bought from dealers. So here are my 68s, 69s, 70s, 71, 72. All right, so from here to here are my 73s. The stuff in the uh, plastic little sleeves here are my better cards. Hall of Famers are better cards. So example, let me pull this one out here. Here's a Lewis Apparatio. Um, not the best player, but uh, still a better card in the set. Also, the reason why they look like there's not that much cards is because they're really scrunched together. I really had to compact the box here. And um, right here, this little dividing spot, this is my 73 doubles card. So this is what I used to trade for cards that don't have in the 73 set. Moving over here, here are my 74 cards, and here are the 74 double replacements. Um, you guys can see here, ton of cards. Um, it's just massive, all this stuff here. I'm trying to complete the 73 and 74 sets. And here are my, um, 75 cards with some plastic sleeves. Um, I actually sold out of all my 75 doubles. 76 cards with some sleeves. 76 and back, I have really nice condition cards in there. 76 doubles. Here are the 77s, 77 doubles, 78, 79, and 80. So that's that. I'm going to go into more depth. And, um, other videos, but thank you guys for watching so much. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next video. Thank you for watching.